and a welcome back to my channel this is daniel from second chance love and i am back with my wand and you're not going to believe this haul so again this is daniel from second chance love welcome back if you are new to my channel welcome and thank you for stopping by to today's fabulously spooky haul and if you are a returning subscriber a welcome back thank you so much for tuning back in so today's haul is going to be all ray done halloween items part bazillion i honestly have lost track how many of videos I've made maybe like four maybe five but I am showing you guys items a mixture of items that I have found myself that I had my Ray Dunn buddy find and also my husband so if I didn't mention already he had gone to Texas to um for work for business and he was out there doing his own Ray Dunn thrifting and if you haven't checked out his channel his channel is thrift sense la here on youtube and you're more than welcome to go check it out and he has a few videos on halloween ray dunn hauls that he has done so definitely go check him out subscribe to his channel and as always you guys let's go ahead and get these formalities out of the way i hope that this video finds you all well and thank you so much again for stopping for today's haul and if you haven't subscribed to my channel already make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you know when the next video is dropped and if you haven't followed me on my social media platforms i welcome you to follow me on instagram which you can find me under second underscore chance underscore love underscore and also on tiktok as second chance love no spaces so i am very happy and excited because i actually feel like i'm running behind guys i said i wanted to show you guys my coffee bar layout and i'm still like buying stuff and I'm trying to still figure things out and Halloween is just around the corner it's already the start of September and I need to get cracking with these hauls I want to show you guys everything that I have and everything that is going to be for my coffee bar setup and also to decorate around my house so I want to show you guys everything I have first before I actually do the whole reveal and the setup videos and all that stuff all the fun part so i want to make sure i get these out asap so i'm going to be pumping out as many videos as i can so without further ado let's go ahead and get this haul started and i hope that you enjoy this if you like what you see i would love and appreciate a like on my video but as always my philosophy goes if you don't like what you see that is absolutely fine you're more than welcome to hit that dislike button totally okay so let's go ahead and get this started now, as you guys know, I always don't go in any specific order. I just grab whatever I have. I have it all surrounded by me. But of course, I'm going to pinpoint what stores they are from and who got them for me to definitely give credit to when credit's needed. So the very first thing that I love is this wooden sign. And my husband actually um, had a bunch of them that he thought would look cute for the house. But I ended up only keeping one of them. And it's this really cute Ray Dunn box kind of frame you want to say it's like a frame it's a wooden frame basically like a wooden picture frame um, but it has Halloween it's absolutely so cute with the little bats Halloween at the bottom and the big jack-o-lantern so adorable Ray Dunn sticker on the top so this is Ray Dunn by design styles for your home which you can find these at TJ Maxx Marshalls and home goods these never sell out you can always find so many different variations and styles for any type of setup that you want to decorate for your home and this was from TJ Maxx for $9.99 so I decided to keep this one it's absolutely so cute and adorable I have another one for my coffee bar that I have that says drink up witches which is perfect but I actually really like this one too just because of the big jack o lantern and that's what halloween is mostly known for is pumpkins so i thought this was really cute so i kept this one for myself and the next item floating our way is going to be this ray dunn artisan collection ceramic bowl with lid i showed you guys previously in my other haul that i had another one that was ghosts well this one is orange absolutely stunning color and it has the word boo in the middle and then it's surrounded by a bunch of jack-o-lanterns so absolutely adorable this bowl is actually smaller than the other one that i showed you guys and the lid does come with a vent so that you can microwave in it and this is like a very medium-sized bowl perfect um for like keeping oh as always food um leftovers a quick mini lunch anything in here and it's really good it's made very well and i love it it's really cute and 
the thing is with these i'm probably going to keep them for the whole year um, because you always need storage but i can't wait to see what christmas ones come out hopefully they bring out some christmas designs because those are going to be really cute as well as the halloween ones and this one is from home goods and this was $5.99. This is actually from Texas. My husband found this in Texas and he brought this one for me. So I was so happy and excited because these are really cute. Let me know in the comments below, guys, if you like this item or if you see anything that you like. I, You guys know that I love and appreciate every comment or feedback that you give me and I love responding back to you. So let me know what catches your eye in this haul. The next item is one of my all-time favorites from this haul that I'm showing you guys because it's my very, very, very first Radon birdhouse and it's Halloween themed. Um, scratch that, sorry. It's not the very first Radon um, birdhouse that I have. It's the first Halloween one that I have. So I was very excited to have found this one. It's absolutely so cute. So it's this boo and it's white and I found this item and it's from tj maxx for $19.99 it's like a normal like birdhouse you know it's very wide and very pointy at the top and it has the word boo in black and on the back it has little bats these are absolutely so adorable i love it it's so cute it comes with this little bow on the top and here's the magenta sticker er, card sorry the magenta card here is the sticker and then the little plug at the bottom. Ray Dunn Artisan Collection by Magenta. It's really cute. I love it. I can't wait to find an area in my house to display it. Again, this is the very first um, birdhouse Halloween theme that I found and I'm so happy I did. Let me know um, what you guys have been experiencing lately. I have been Ray Dunn hunting um, specifically for Halloween in the last few days and I've honestly haven't been coming across any more items i was having really good luck like hitting up the stores right after work i don't know if it's because it's getting closer to halloween is it because more people are buying more let me know what your experience has been because i've been going to stores and i'm literally not finding anything anymore and i actually feel that marshall's and tj maxx are condensing their Halloween sections into smaller and smaller and they're bringing out all the fall stuff so I don't know if it has to do with timing because Christmas is going to be displayed out soon and fall is already here and it's September so let me know in the comments below how your guys' experience has been with Halloween items in store. The next spooky find are these adorable mugs they are mugs with toppers which i am so happy about because i absolutely love them and this one was found by my husband it says basic witch in orange letters with a witch's cap as the topper i had been dying for this one so bad and i was so happy that he was able to find it on in texas and he found so many items guys in texas it's crazy it's not here compared to california where everything is like so rare out in the wild out there there's like so many items it makes me want to jump to texas and like go and find all the items so he got this at home goods and this was for ten dollars absolutely adorable with that little witch's hat at the topper i love it and the other mug that he found me is this spooky cat with the topper and this is so adorable and this is like that glossy black shine that um which one that i showed you it's also the same it has like that really shiny black finish glossy white lettering spooky and it has the cat topper which is absolutely so cute with the little whiskers and nose and eyes very very cute and this one was also i believe from home goods and this was ten dollars so these were absolutely so adorable i love the mugs with the toppers so i'm very excited to see what comes out for fall i have already been seeing a few of them so i can't wait to see what christmas comes i love love christmas and i can't wait until they get these items out but here they are thank you again to my husband for finding these amazing items out in texas so another mug that i actually found was at tj maxx it was for 5.99 and it's another halloween radon mug toil and trouble black lettering classic white ceramic and in the back it has the witch's cauldron which is so absolutely cute i love this it's so so cute 
normal inside no color it's really cute and i love it and it goes with the theme of my um, halloween section so i have a few sections in my house that i'm preparing to decorate and this is going to be perfect for that space i'm going to have specific areas like ray dunn is going to be themed throughout different areas of the home so i can't wait to put this where i am envisioning it in my head hopefully it all comes out the way that i think it will and the next item guys do not laugh i'm telling you guys right now it's ray dunn and yes, it's probably more for children, but I could not pass this up. It was so adorable and I just wanted it so bad because it reminded me of a bag and I love bags, you know, carry bags, you know, to carry your stuff in like purses or anything like that. I absolutely love them. So when I found it, I knew I just had to have it. So they do have different variations and this is the one that I bought. So this is a trick or treat bag. And yes, I say that it's for children because it's supposed to be a candy pail. It's like a canvas bag, a canvas candy pail, but I don't care. I think this is absolutely so adorable. It says trick or treat. This was a TJ Maxx find and it was for $7.99. It has a cylindrical bottom. And what I fell in love with, guys, is the inside. It does come with this handle. It's not too long, so it's definitely going to be more of a shoulder bag for me than anything. And I just thought it was so adorable. But what was inside is what I absolutely fell in love with, and that's why I wanted it so bad. It's the adorable print. And they actually have a bunch of different ones, guys, with different scenes. Um, I believe one of them was Happy Halloween. And then there was another one, I think, that just had, like, a pumpkin. It was so cute. But the inside, and I'm just reversing the canvas back so I can show you how it looks like, is the print on the inside. Look at how adorable this is. All the little pumpkins with the ghosts. Oh, my gosh. It's just so cute. I absolutely love it. Here's the Ray Dunn tag on the inside. So it's just absolutely adorable. I loved it and I because I just couldn't pass up on it. And yes, again, it's for candy, but it will definitely work for me for Halloween or I mean, I could probably use it all year. I, I don't care. I love it and I think it was a really cool find. So the next item that I'm going to show you guys, I think actually ties in with the birdhouse because it's also one of my favorite favorites and again thank you so much to my husband for finding it for me i love you so much and appreciate that you brought this home in one piece because it didn't break and it's perfect so i had been on the hunt for this witch's brew cauldron and i originally wanted the mug but i did not have any luck so my husband did the next best thing and brought me the actual cauldron look at this thing it's huge so huge next to my head it's so adorable it's like in this matte black finish with white lettering that says witch's brew and it's a cauldron a cauldron with the handles absolutely stunning i love this piece and i definitely already know the perfect spot where i'm going to display it for my halloween decorations so this was a tj maxx find and it was for 20 dollars and he found this in texas and on the back is the most cutest thing if you guys know here is the recipe so it's absolutely so adorable let me tell it to you guys really quick two cups putrid pumpkin one cup mystery slime one tablespoon of cobwebs two drops of bat squeaks one rat tail one eye of newt one dried spider please brew in cauldron mix in dry ingredients add mystery slime stir and let simmer for two hours let cool and enjoy so this is such a cool piece i love it and this is the thing that i'm having trouble with a lot of people i see have displayed it like this because you can see the recipe and then some people have displayed it this way because it says witch's brew so let me know in the comments below what way would you guys display it witch's brew or recipe towards the front front i am excited to know what you guys think i am twisted because i like this but then of course i like this so let me know in the comments below what you guys think
The other item that I have for this haul is not a radon related and it's actually a Michael's craft store item but I wanted to show this to you guys because I want to make sure I show you again everything and I thought it would be a good place to show this item because I'm going to use it to display out for Halloween and it's this very cute tiny treasures house that I found at Michael's. It's absolutely adorable. It's a 9 by 8 inches and 17 inches in height and it does require assembly so basically it's like a wooden little doll house it's absolutely so cute it has the moon with stars and windows and this requires um, wood glue so if you buy this from michael's make sure that you buy yourself some wood glue because you are going to need it and i already have it set up and it's already ready and it's absolutely adorable it's just supposed to be like a little wooden house and they have accessories that you can buy to decorate with like miniatures but i thought it was absolutely cute for a different kind of way that i'm going to use it so i'm very excited to share that with you guys and how i style this up my last few items are in thanks to my friend brian he's my other ray dunn buddy thank you so much again brian if you're watching this video you are always the best at letting me know when you find items and asking if i want them thank you so much you are really a great friend i am so in love with them so i'm going to show you guys the very first one it's another topper mug trick or treat i had been on the hunt for the longest for this little guy he is absolutely so adorable it's an orange gloss finish pumpkin with black trick-or-treat letters and the topper is a pumpkin it's so cute i absolutely love it and this was a marshall's fine for ten dollars i love this absolutely one of my favorite mugs that has toppers and another mug that he found for me is a cackle with delight and this was also a marshall's find for 5.99 these were also ones that I had been seeing a lot of people find and I was dying to find one. On the back it has the purple witch's hat, which is absolutely so adorable. Love it, love it, love it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I don't know if you guys have already started hunting for the fall items. I I feel so bad for myself because I did not buy them and now they're getting very, very difficult to find. I wanted some fall mugs that were Ray done for fall when fall came around and I would put away my Halloween collection and I only wanted like a minimum of maybe four or five of the mugs and I wanted these like um they're like a very burgundy color that a lot of them are in the cozy color and also the canisters that says cozy those are the ones that I was in on hunt for and I haven't had any luck finding them and I beat myself up for it because I did see them one day but I just didn't want to buy them because I figured you know what I'm not focused on fall right now I'll do Halloween I'm sure they'll be around no 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 did I learn the hard way that's why you have to find when you find things buy them buy them when you see them because it's no bueno no good but he found me a fall mug and I absolutely love it because it's going to kickstart off my fall item collection. So he found me this adorable fall mug with lettering that says fall in black. It has three little pumpkins which mimics the same Halloween ones that have the three candy corns at the bottom. So I thought this was absolutely so cute. And the inside is like a light orange. It's very pretty. I love it. And he found this also at Marshall's for $5.99. Absolutely adorable. I cannot wait until I find more fall mugs. Let me know in the comments below, guys. Have you been finding the fall mugs? I find it like it's a lot more difficult now to find these items. I don't know why. I remember from Ray Dunn Buddies that we were waiting when we would open stores because I used to do um, opening stores when, you know, waiting in line outside until the store opens. Um, and they said that Halloween is like the most sought out collection, but it looks like it's also with every other holiday. So let me know in the comments below. I am a newbie. I consider myself a newbie for radon hunting. I've only been doing it for almost two years. So that's definitely newbie. Um, but let me know in the comments below if you guys have found any fall related items in your stores. Okay, my spectacular friends, that is the end of today's haul. Let me know in the comments below, as always, what did you like best from this haul? Again, I am tied with the cauldron because it was a definite find that I had been wanting so bad, but also the birdhouse. So let me know in the comments below, which of my items did you guys like? 
Do you have any of these items? Is there something that you're still looking for? I mean, September just started and I don't know if they're going to keep bringing out more Halloween items, but is there something that you guys are still looking for? Let me know in the comments below. As always, if you guys liked what you see, make sure to hit that like button and give me all the comments. I love, love, love responding to all of you. And as always, I hope that this video finds you well. We are a step closer for me to release my video on my coffee bar because again, I wanna release all these items before I actually start placing around and playing around with the setup and how I wanna display it. And I'm still looking for a few more key items that I wanna do, um, that I wanna find that are Ray Dunn related before I actually start constructing my coffee bar and layouts of my home but i am working fast and furious because i really want to get that started because it's going to be so much fun so make sure to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already hit the notification bell so you know when the next video drops out and go ahead and also check out my husband on his page his instagram um sorry his youtube channel is thrift sense la and I'll go ahead and link it down below in the description of the video if you want to go ahead and follow him there. He would love and appreciate it as well if you checked out his videos. And until next time, guys, I hope that this video finds you well. Stay safe and stay spectacular. Bye, friends. Bye.